will be the B hit here. 45 seconds remaining. Thrust been waiting for this this whole time. That smoke he plans to deploy will separate them and stop those fights coming so easy. Lots of fights coming in now, though, and the first does go the way of RPK. Not quick to equalize. They charge in. Lots of targets and a bomb down thanks to Masuta. It's looking pretty good for Vitality, but they're not looking towards a kitchen at all. Ekro helps himself to a freebie there, but RPK did manage to pick up a frag initially. It's looking like this is a confirmed round for Vitality. Two versus one. Lecro up against Zywell and Shocks, and you'll see the format take him down, no problem whatsoever. A big contact play that works out. Lecro is a bit of a uh, Mirage specialist when the chips are down. Yeah, oh. well, Twist, apparently, he's not bad either. There's a couple of kills on these Desert Eagles. Make it three in total. Jesus. Apex answering back, but he's being tagged up. And back and forth we go. It's not clear we'll be picking up the round. Both of them incredibly low on the T side oh. here as Lecro will pick another one off. Just left the shocks. Known for his clutch potential, but only has 12 points of health here. And very fast round here, Chad. You, you uh... Going through this, we call it the murder hole for a reason. He's going to get the frag. Does he go for it straight away? <sighs> Oh, he's actually pulled this off. Not quite. Plopsky Ooh. now knows where his opponent is. He's tucked into the off angle, and he just has to pull the trigger. Clean deagle headshot. Hello. Oh, what do you make of that one? Uh, that was a nice shot by RPK. I make that. that that's what I make of that. Let's see if we can do both on the eco rush. Give us the commentary and the. And the oh, well, the push towards mid. Gonna get absolutely destroyed here. Twist now, followed up with another. Gets another one. Oh my lord! And one left alive. RPK left alone. MP9 in hand. It's not gonna work out. And they take the round. The Good side energy, of ninjas rush. and pajamas. That's the kind of that's inspiration need. I needed. Incendiary just to get four players in there as well. Oh, he's burning! Oh, he's oh, really oh, is. That's a nightmare. Poor Masuta. Oh, what a nasty way to go down. <laughs> just having to go. Um, and Zywu just pull one back here. They're back into the round. It's glass cannon for Zywu. Apex to lead the charge him. I mean, there's four players in for the bomb site, and they are being picked off wow. like flies here. Oh, he's so in trouble. Twist under a lot of pressure. He'll get sprayed through and hunted down. All on to Plopsky. He's had a fantastic tournament. Now on his birthday, he's been dealt a one versus four. With the second round on the board here, a big one as well, because take a look at the NIP money. Here you can see this jumping up, trying to take the aggro for his team. And now they're going to run oh. past. This is big from Nork. Oh, he's waiting for the bomb. He could get all three here. Oh, and he does split, find the first <laughs> two, the third as well. <laughs> shutting them big. all down. That trigger discipline. That's something we talked about vitality having. Maybe where Throat would come in and say, you're by yourself at this stage. Everyone has pulled back. That's Zywu. He can easily he open up a round. <laughs> he says it. He does it. Perfect. Well, here comes the flank from Plopsky as well and T spawn. So still looking very good for an NIP situation, even though it's uh, three versus three. 20 seconds oh remaining. God. And of course, he hits that shot. How? They're back into this. That's going to be two kills for Zywu. They have the man advantage with the plant. I'll be denied. Chill now. Don't have to do anything else. 13 seconds. The sound cue you need hasn't come in yet. So I will provide it again. Nine seconds and Masuta's hit the deeg. Bomb can be planted now. Plopsky's been dealt into the clutch, and he can find perhaps the second as well. Zywu's so low. Plopsky's running oh, out of bullets, and no. Zywu saves the day. <laughs> An unarmored deagle and a clutch. The M4, it connects. I mean, it's a, it's a nasty world out there. Oh. Great catch from Zywu, tracing him go. nicely, and already an opening frag. Twist will claw one back. And with Lair Rez falling, their chance is starting to dwindle. Plopsky has to go big here on the defense. Oh, it's... he's past him. Oh, oh. everyone's oh. blind. Flashed. And there it is. The kill will come in Apex. He'll get a freebie, but it's going to be Plopsky to try and pull the round back in NRP's favor here. They'll have the orbit spawn. AWP use up. Some swing out, and Zywu's just on oh, something else yeah. today. He's in the zone right now. That's really not where you want him to be. Yeah, no helmet. Twist felt that. That M4 really hurts, and now looking for his second. Plopsky was not prepared, and so Masuta. Lecro's Deagle's strong. If they, get, if they lose another rifle here, and they have, they could very well watch this round get ripped from them. Apex trying to take a bit of space here, up into and through the connector smoke, and that gap has paid off, but only for one. Well, he made a gap. Look, the rotation on the minimap right now, they left the B bomb site, but there's not enough time. Plopsky's there. That stage. He's coming in now with the AWP. 
Molotov deployed and the scout doesn't quite connect. So the orb, a chance to take him down. There will smoke off towards kitchen instead here. And RPK, if he gets this kill, they really are onto something. But two scout shots connecting here. Surely, oh, no. Zywo, after missing that one, won't have much of a chance here. Down to 14 HP, just a matter of time. And there we have it. NIP with a bit of luck going in their favor for one to four surviving. Suta from the palace position, and wow, that pre-fire really hurts. Look at this. It's simple. It's effective. Twist, however, oh. disagrees. He nearly got three. Masuta will try and get that bomb down. He's vulnerable to the HE, but the Molotovs have got enough space, enough distance to make that impossible. Plosky uses this nade. That's a frag. Masuta's dead. Doable now. They have smokes. One smoke towards the bomb position. Another to stop that ramp info. He can cross safely to the bomb. Spray does do damage. Apex knows he's got to deal with it, but Nork, he's holding the cross, and Plopsky's holding the bomb. It's oh. on to Shoxy. He's done the damage, but the defuse does come in in time. Oh. A sick for the ninjas, and it is through the ninja. There's no one there from the CTs. They're moving so fast that unless shots get oh. hit, they're going to be in a lot of trouble. Nork's avoided a lot. <gasps> and now Plopsky baits it in. He's going to have to start shooting. Now the bomb's in apps, though. One committed to the site, caught by Twist, and the ninjas have held the door. What a sick play that was to close out the half. NIP with the crossfire from hell. Seven right down the middle, as you would expect. And it's a B rush coming in here from NIP. We have got the flashbangs delivered. And it's Twist to lead the charge here, as he'll find uh, three players on the other side. And the first kill will be landing in favor of RPK. Oh. The ninja's trying to answer back, but it's not looking good at all for them. That's their first kill. Yeah, but Lecro, maybe another. Oh. oh, and into the site, there's one more that remains. Apex, spotted now by Rez and found. He's the last. It's Masuta. He doesn't have the health. Rez's nade could do some damage, but avoided. Got a minute remaining and just 11 points of health. Masuta still tucked in towards the bench. They're right next to each other. Masuta seems to be aware of it. And well, that's going to give it up. Oh. And the kill comes in. Rez had one bullet to make that work. Doesn't land. This can feel an open playing field. I say that. Rez has given them the warning shot. Now all pushing in. And he's got one. Not bad for Zywu. He'll take Nork out. And RPK's managed to get another as well. They're keeping this competitive. Plopsky's in a lot of trouble. And the whole down of Mouse 1 does net shocks 1. Down to the 2 on 1, though. He's got to do a lot more than that. He's got the Flamas in hand, a couple of flashbangs to operate with, but they seem to know exactly where he is. He'll be challenged any second. Plopsky there with the glow in hand. Flashbang delivered. Apex, very aware of their presence, but that's oh. a nice shot from Zywu. Gets away, that's the most important part. He lives to fight another day. Plopsky fighting as well. Catches shocks, advantage again for the T side. They haven't checked Masuta though, but now he's been spotted. And it's not a clean kill, it's just damage. Twist still alive and that enables him to plant that bomb. Scary plan when Zywo is alive at the orb. He'll be announcing his presence from CT spawn. Flashbang delivered, but he'll dodge it. Jumps up on the CT boxes. He knows exactly where the first player is, and he'll detect Twist as well. Back down to the two-on-two. -two. No grenades available from oh. the CT side, but they've got skill in bolos here. Zywo will find his third of the round. Needs a fourth to go down to the one versus one. Has to go for this defuse of oh. Legro. Great play, overwhelming. A stifling flashbang as well. And uh, it's going to work perfectly if he can get in towards B, no helmets. Imagine if he gets uh, the same opening frag. We saw the SMG bounding you know. in and a good chance for it. My God, he tames the MAC-10 spray. And that's going to get the CTs to over-rotate, you'd imagine. They didn't spot the bomb. And now Shox has gone down on A, perhaps trying to return to that site. There's only two of them left, though. I'm so happy teams are starting to realize the power of the MAC-10 and how to utilize it correctly. Yeah. Don't need five of them, don't need two of them, just one at the front of the pack, positioned correctly with the right strategy involved. Like, it can be a very interesting weapon. We'll see Plotsky go down eventually, and that's going to be a key frag for Lecro. Four versus one, and Zywu remains, and he's uh -oh. actually towards short. Uh-oh. And he has managed to... Spot the first. Lecro goes down. What do they do now? Yeah, pivot. Get their but health they have to away. Still get past it. And he's going to hear them in underpass. Oh, surely not. Nade does great damage towards Twist. He's got oh, two he's to deal in. with, and he doesn't find it. A chance for Zywu in a very promising one. The threat of the AWPs and shocks. Does he put to the test now? The first shot doesn't land. The second should be no problem. Much easier for him. And they've actually got a lot of manpower here towards A. Shocks nice. will find his second. That Orp is looking very powerful. Four versus two. Rez and Nork up against it now as he finds his third. This is why he's bringing it out. That's the best round I've seen from him in some time of the AWP. A player in towards CPL. They're going for the B execution here. So expect to see the two smokes towards the pillars, but RPK gets stuck and it's when the orb can really come online now. Shocks. 
doesn't drop off. He'll have to now. The Flames landing at his front door, and they've done enough. They've actually bought a lot of time here. Four versus two. A chance to fall back. They don't have to take these fights. Wait for an IP to come in. Okay, a great smoke from Shox. He can tuck it on the bench position, and it baits them into Apex. Twist will be able to at least deal with the first, opting for the rifle for the rest of this round. It could be quite short, though, because Zaiwu's got the line. And the double orbs, they passed their second test. First, a 4K from Shox, and now dividing and conquering. It's three. This is great. It's very dynamic. This is straight up B rush, and Zaiwu's there. He'll drop the incendiary. He'll spot a load the of them. The grenade good. is lovely as well. It's going to do a what? ton of damage. And it's actually the first kill. What's up? RPK. Okay. He's a timed out. Oh, timed no. Down. He's still alive, though. Is he in the smoke or something? I don't know what's going on there. Where is he? He's... Yeah. He can't still be... He must no. have disconnected, right? He can't... He can't be in the smoke or something. You can't alive. be... <laughs> so it's a 2v4. It is a, definitely a 2v4 right now, unless he just miraculously but, comes back. Yeah, but he, we can see him. How can't they? He's, okay, he just he moved. Is. He has some life in him. No, they, they shot <laughs> he him. He flinched. It was oh, like a scarecrow. It's like a scarecrow, right? He got shot in there. It's like, just the wind, Henry. It's not I'm real. <laughs> Scarecrows aren't real. Now, unfortunately... RPK, advantage could still exist, but not going to get out of dodge. And I'm starting to get nervous about that AWP switch up. They've got two of them to hold this site. Now RPK can advance a great shot, but a second comes in. RPK's doing a lot here, and it's down to our nervous res. Oh, it's my lord. It's not planted for him. RPK's got to the site. Zywu, however, down. He calls the bluff on RPK. He's oh, defused, and he gets big. them both. That's a huge clutch at a monumental moment of the game. Genuinely upset. I was How like, have they programmed that? me? Oh, 23. Okay, but, so. Um, I was like, I realized that. Oh! oh! <laughs> Great shots from Zywu. Maybe there's still a chance. It's on Masuta. He's caught a bullet, though, and he will go down. A chance delivered by Zywu <laughs> in the middle of nowhere. After a controversial moment, a disconnect from RPK. They gave up their lead, but they can still fight back for it here, and Zywu willing to do just that. That's two kills from him, five on three. Can you smell it? Oh, I, I can, can smell overtime already. Have lost all of that ground. RPK's taking a knock. Wow, just walks in. A leisurely stroll out of Palace could very well book them for overtime. And a pistol force buy from their opponents in the process. They've bounced straight back and now just two frags away from taking us to OT. The wall bang does come in, tags him up, and looks like Twist will keep fighting just a moment longer. Yeah, just a formality at this stage. There'll be absolutely no chance he can pull this one off. Four versus one. They have the bomb as well. And there it is. Down towards Shaw. Vitality have done enough. They'll remain on the CT side. Zywu thinking for cover. One drops straight behind. Nork didn't think to check it, but neither did Masuta. A second descends. And a double kill on the entry. Zywu just swinging wide and actually nearly taking a pot shot through the smoke. Whoa. Oh, three on three. Now the bomb will go down. And Zywu, he isn't slowing down. Shots tries to puncture the smoke here. And he will be removed by Plopsky. It's oh absolute pandemonium here. And Zywu, it looks likely he can still win this one. The wall bang tantalizingly closed that oh. one even better. Rez. Locked out in the one versus one, and Zywu will have no utility. Makes his way towards the bomb now. Can he find anything on the floor here? Going for the full defuse, it might be enough. His presence alone, it would have been enough. But Rez making that sound cue. He'll be swinging in and he's timed it perfectly. It will be NIP with the first round, but very similar to that B bomb. Sorry. He's missed a shot already. Look how much space they've taken already. Smokes are starting to bloom. Zywu does not make the same mistake twice. Masuta trades, and we keep it level. 3v3. These air executions are providing a lot of fun here. Very scrappy counter-strike and damage being thrown across the map here. Apex will find Twist, and they'll take the man advantage. Great grenade lands in the pocket of Nork. Perhaps a second sound cue to come. One kitchen, which is perfectly being held by Plopsky, and now RPK's gone. Big. And as they turn, Plopsky strikes for another. This is gorgeous counter-strike. Well, Shocks now can't believe that's just happened. He's in a two versus one. They had all the advances going for them there, but they were too focused. Here we go. Hang he on. He can still defuse this, though. Going for it. Touches the bomb, and oh, they're taking no! the bait, and he has pulled it off. Shoxy with another clutch, and he needs to find the bomb, which he will. Shox is the one that's going to look for the info, and yeah, very precise. That's his 28th. He's definitely had his cornflakes this morning. Or his sandwich. Or his three sandwiches. That doesn't sound healthy. I, was, I wanted to say, I was like, you might want to get a more varied diet, perhaps. You know, I thought that, and then I lived with uh, uh, someone who lived in the Netherlands, and they just eat bread all the time. Just every bread, every breakfast, up. gotta have bread. I guess it's a versatile meal in itself. You can put different things inside there. It just seems like the sandwich... 
I don't know, it's more of a snack for me. I don't like know. ketchup. Yeah, ketchup sandwiches. <laughs> That's the whole thing in itself. Chad's ketchup sandwich propaganda needs to stop now. <laughs> They're definitely not great for you. I'm not forcing the sandwich on you guys. <laughs> if you want to eat the ketchup sandwich, you can eat the ketchup sandwich. <laughs> After their slip-ups in the first of this overtime, and he gets caught just as he started to reposition a Masuta. What an impact he's had in this round. It could be over, especially with shocks onto Nork. Now yeah. the A site's all guarded by one man, and, and they can hear his scope. Lecro will have to hit a few shots here, and he's got the first. I dare say he's got the second as well. Masuta, though, nice play. What a big round from this young man here. Three in total in overtime. He knows exactly where Plopski is as well. The flashbang delivered. Doesn't necessarily catch him. Looking for his fourth, and he converts it. Lovely stuff there from Masuta. 25 seconds left, they're going Ooh, to have to push have through to. it. Lecro's trying to play as ratty as he can. He wants him to run into him as an obstacle, and it works so well. He actually only caught one, and it was through the smoke onto Apex. So much hang time for Twist. He hasn't got the shot yet. He was so blind, and now Nork's been hunted. Zai Wu just opened up the site as if he's got a rifle. The last two in a lot of trouble, especially now Plopski's been left all alone. Zai Wu, hang on, they line up. If he had a nade, it could have been the end of shocks, but he retreats to CT. He does have an aid now. Oh, and it could be perfect. Has he done the calculations? Good. He does, dunks him, and spots the last. But RPK secures it. Vitality will take their map pick. Interestingly enough, that's all his planned route entails. It's up towards middle. They're about to have quite the fight. And RPK, oh, okay. only getting the one. Instead, the NIP boys have taken full control and now pivoting into shots. He does get the first, needs it to second, and runs out of bullets, runs out of speed. Masuta, he could be in a lot of trouble here. I think he might be. His days are numbered. It looks very good for NIP to pick up this pistol as they make their way towards B. The Molotov will lock out. Running out of bullets as well, to be honest with you, on Apex side. They'll have just... 12 remaining. Oof, Nork does take out Apex's uh, ace in the hole. Pivot into B nicely, and they've got all those smokes to keep them at bay. They ended up dropping one towards the doors of the uh, underpass area, and then they had a second for Monster when they spotted Apex. A single flash, and look at Zywu, he's getting He's caught dead. in transition. He's a dead man walking. He will go down, the MAC-10 being utilized perfectly. They've got two of them, and jumping to find the frag. That's a great display of what it's capable of. Well, there we have it. It is going to be another round for an IP. You can see why they've picked this one is Vitality. And Zywu and Shocks have nothing to say about it whatsoever. 0-4 for Shocks. Oh, Zywu, I should say. 1 for 4 for Shocks. Nork will pull 1 back. That's, uh... Ooh. Sandwiched. Timing. Dead. Less than favorable timing for Apex. Masuta will preserve and Rez will upgrade his Galil. Zywu readies himself for war. We'll go down to Nork and... Their chances are going to get real depleted if they lose shocks on the site, and Lecro's caught him again. Yeah, the advantage they had has been thwarted. This Ooh. is the only chance RPK can get a one dig. They're back into the round here, and he's managed to deliver. Apex will find another as well. Uh -oh. Can he find the penultimate frag? It's to a two on two. Masuta and RPK. Remember, Masuta went to a T spawn. So, Bomb will be on the side. Still got time to go towards B, but now no longer an option. Nork with 20 points of health here. He's suggesting he's on towards the B's the side of the map. One versus one, Masuta to pre-fire. He should have the round here. And there it is. The first for Vitality. They had to work so hard for it, though. Flash, Shox is going to peek off this. And that's one, maybe even two. He was faffing around with his nades. Plopsky caught. The French have managed to dig themselves into a very possible second round. Yeah, and the five on two is looking good for them. Lecro down to 13. Nork, if they are going to have a chance here, he'll need to find two of these girls right now. The first, probably going to happen. There it is. I just don't think there'll be much to be said about the second. They've got no chance to even plant the bomb now. But I don't know why RPK is pushing that one. He doesn't have anything to say about collecting weapons. You can see he had no money as well. He gets 3,500. Pro to NIP. And if they don't have sewer control, it makes their rotation back even harder. Haven't seen that boost for a while, and it works out. That's going to be a nice opening kill. Zywo baits it out and actually goes for the AK-47 instead. It's going to be a nice kill through the smoke. Masuta backs him up. And they're not going to assume Zywo's there with the AWP. Bear in mind, this is a great adjustment from him. He could be on for a couple of kills, but he oh. will be split apart there. It's going to be a three versus two. Apex of a decent flank and deny the default plum. They've gone for a bank side approach. Bomb's still toilets. Oh, yeah, Lecro right. could go down. And he wasn't expecting that so fast. And now with RPK, they can win this round. Cold as ice. Working from barrels, Apex to join him. And this smoke would it work out for the first two kills for an IP. Great stuff. It really is. And Mamasuta's been tasked with an 
possible task. He's only got the first before going down. Zaiwu won't be able to stop the plant. He will still have his heart beating and that AWP in his hands. So perhaps that's the last on the site was Masuta and he's only going to good for one. Maybe Zaiwu gets another there and that's going to put Legro in the grave. He still has... Masuta boosted up. Oh, okay. Really not looking comfortable out there. Quite a clumsy vault up. Didn't have a chance to coordinate the aim and it's going to be another opening pick for an IP and it's going to walk oh, and be here. Uh, no, they're going to get caught out here. Yeah, they're going to swarm. Yeah, this is where the trades get very difficult to succeed. And already dropping in, Rez will only go down and, and now perhaps with Apex's double, there's still a round to be had. Definitely is now. Two versus two. Didn't think there was a chance. Good grenade. Bonk. Zywu going down for sure. And Apex, he probably makes up for this one, but still a good spray for Nork there. There they were able to pick up nine T rounds. Oh, shocks! He was so blind and he nearly takes three. Rez has only got 12 HP. Oh, oh Apex. Apex. That's not gone well. Oh, dear. That couldn't have gone worse for him. And Masuta could very well go down. He's taken the fight and he commits to it. They had an advantage in this one. And now, fortunately, RPK will claw it back. Yeah, pretty ridiculous scenes here. And he does find the first. That was on the healthy member as well. It's close. He doesn't know. Oh, the patience from Rez could very well translate into a round win here. A clutch. Yes, low HP, but up against an AWP. And now with the bomb down, his advantage starts to swell. Playing around the smoke, but Zai was coming from short. Rez was still anticipating the heaven rotate. And Players here with the rifles, smoke down towards bathrooms, flashbang the follow on both sides of the equation, and it's a success for one shot. This time, only finds a single kill. Oh, Apex wants to hold them back, and he's worked wonders alongside Zaiwu. They get so much done in the opening stages. The first 10 seconds of the round, and it's a 2v2. This B bomb side towards Shaw is becoming a real issue for them. As soon as they get advantages, it's He'll be going to check that out, but he has to be modeled of that himself. So, can't really do much about this. I have to wait for Masuta to come in from the connector, and he already has started that. Low HP on towards Nork oh. as well. I'm missing Zywo take him down. Masuta, no chance. Twist will find him. 9-5, final round coming up next. And Molotov available for Optimus as well, and this is going to be a real difficult affair for Vitality. Rez, he'll continue to well. find headshot after headshot, looking for his third, and he'll convert him. Just RPK, no chance of winning the round. Just going to be looking for any... Kills available to pad the old stats. He could certainly use one or two. He won't get it though. Twist hits the shot. Rez just demands respect. Deployed. I wonder what happens next. A gap right. perhaps. But will certainly deny them. Helps him set up behind it though. And the flank from Plopsky was being waited for. Shocks can't believe his luck. They're pushing up. They want info and Apex can't believe his luck. He's got another. Rez hiding the barrel by staring into the wood, but checked by Zywu. The French have surely done enough here. It's just Nork, and he's gone too. Well, there it is. Big round for Vitality to pick up there. Rez, that's where he's holding. So smoked off. And now this is where Vitality can really coordinate their troops, make their way in. They're taking a lot of damage, but still yet to give a player till now. And that should seal okay. it. Twist has actually done a lot with that scout. Woo. Apex, fortunately, he'll find a pair of frags alongside RPK. Right about, well, then. Perez caught the first. RPK is going for the plan and Molotov for the retake. Don't want to let him oh, retreat. He, can't, he can't go through it. He can, oh. though. He gets away just. Let me out, let me out. And Masuta will take the upgrade. Now RPK will be the bait. If the Mac 10 and 4 HP, he can just look for info. Something to slow them down. Good flash. It's going to be enough for Shox to swing off this one. He'll get the kill. And still, CT finding kills here. It's going to be just Zyra remaining. I say that. Two versus one now. And do they have the kids? They actually don't right now. So oh. he gets this kill. He probably wins the round, but it will be the AWP to pick him up there. A flash over the top, and here it comes. In they go. It's going to be the first kill for an IP, and Rez starts mowing them down. Very comfortable from the bomb side. It's going to be a four versus two. Chad already laid out this is a very important round for Vitality. Have they got anything left to say about this one? Potentially, oh. that was the moment. And now Zywu, nothing left to do here. Three versus one, low HP. Just a matter of time before he goes down. Knows where Lekro is hiding. He just wishes there's a wallbang available. Eventually, it will just go down. He could get a collateral here. There's a chance of a trade, but oh. now no chance. Good stuff. Perfect. And into the side with a double kill. This is a dream for Vitality, but Lekro, he slows them right down. A double. Bomb will be planted. Advantage for Vitality. The nade won't do too much. 
And only Twist and Rez. Oh. What on earth? Hits him straight through the smoke, straight through the box. He hasn't gone for it. It would have worked. That could be it. As RPK finds a penultimate kill here, it's going to be 13 to 9 unless Twist can find both of them with the one digs right here, right now. Great effort there from Lecro at the back. His teammates going down, managed to almost get three kills. Now they come. Shocks, or oh, not the cleanest first start for him, but he does do some significant That's damage. Two. That's much cleaner. On for two, and it's Apex to convert, so they'll take that all day long. No one has to commit to the bomb site. They can slow it down, but they are absolutely sending it. It's worked out for them, and the bomb goes down. Oh, he was expecting RPK Big to kill, keep moving. Huge kill. Oh, that was, yeah, a potential saved orb, but not anymore. Especially if he gets this kill. Now Rez has a chance to, but they're oh, going to want to stop they're this. They're chasing. Look at the radar. Everyone's coming for him. One. Shulks falls. He's got two to survive so far. If they over-egg the pudding, things could get awkward. He's got another, and he's still got health to work with. Singing their praises to kick this one off, saying, oh, this is, this is fantastic. They stopped the orb being picked up. That's all they're doing towards the end. God. He couldn't be he's more in the driving seat. <gasps> no. no, wait. Very okay. strange outcome. <laughs> now he's kind of trapped. He's going to get the hell out of there. From behind enemy lines, he will descend. Doesn't get caught with a nade in his hands. The warning shot did clip him. They can still make this round work, but they need to be cognizant of the fact that flanks can come through. Oh, he got oh, it. Zyro oh, no somehow has hit that shot. I couldn't tell you that was even humanly possible, but... Making dreams a reality here. It's going to be Lecro going for the flank, and it's all down to the timings once again, and it will be Masuta coming out on top. Three versus two. Big kill oh! from Storks. This is absolutely massive now. This round looked like it was under lock and key for an IP, and now Twist finds himself on the two versus one. First should be no problem. In towards Shoxy, but still, he shuts it all down, denies everything there. When we go towards B, they're swinging for the fences here. Plopsky will be tested. He does a load of damage, but they know exactly where he is. Trying to find the key shots here. They've got to take down Nork. He's got the AWP, and they're aware of it. Big oh. frag coming in. Plopsky will find it. The orb still alive and kicking. Nork will continue to find success. Shoxy, oh. 22 kills. He makes a huge footstep there. That might be his chances thwarted. Trying to get itself the hell out of this one, but it will be the orb to shut him down there, and NIP will tie things up. It is going to be about the halfway point coming up momentarily. Smoke down towards Shaw from the CTs here. Shoxy will receive flames and he'll go down here. The flashbang spot on. That's thrown by Twist. RPK has to be much more active here and he knows it. Yeah, so the flash is good. Anticipating the push does spot the head of Rez and Twist. The oh! tank's done it all. What year is it? First Shoxy, now RPK. He'll steal the orb away. Yeah, so this is great news. And oh no, no, caught in transition. He gets Zywoo. It's looking very scrappy here, but Shoxy does pull one back. They're not really sure where they want to finish up. They're not going to be aware of Rez. He's going to open this door in a second and find a guaranteed frag, maybe even two. You can see absolute panic setting in the ranks of Vitality here. It's not yeah. really clear where they're ending up. They're bumping into oh, each other. Oh, heaven's missed. RPK wants that duel before he starts working on the plant, and it actually has worked out well. Bomb can be planted. It's all on RPK. There's no way he can do this again, surely. Twist is in heaven. From behind, he has Rez to worry about if the timing works out. Oh my god, he's just snuck through and now he gets the first. He's dead, there's no way, there's no way. He's called the bluff on the first. He's even got a Molotov. That doesn't look too bad. Doesn't need to swing out. And uh, Wait, no he kit. still does. He doesn't have a kit. You're absolutely there's right, no Chad. You observe and hell. Oh there my goodness, tight. he's still he's got, got it. Oh. They hold on. This range needs to be very careful here. Go. How is he still alive? He's tried to get the smoke down. The flash was enough, but he's actually seeing his teammates get the frags. NIP with three. Apex, if he can just find Lecro, perhaps there's a chance. Zywe with the bomb, but he's gone. Double from Rez, same for Lecro. Yeah, looks like that's exactly the plan. Flash and go, folks. And not blind, and they just pull the trigger. Oh, Shox just changed his mind, and now three, nearly four, five. They're all dead. It's 18. Well. Uh. For Monster, smoke at heaven. One flash over, Apex. Good for one, but a lot more action towards the B side. Yeah, but Zywu still standing. That's a chance. Incendiary will make things difficult for Twist to post plant. He's burning to a crisp, but Shox has found another. Perhaps Vitality have, excuse the pun, found life. Lecro's found Apex. 1v1. Shox knows where he is. The smoke from Lecro is perfect. He can disappear. He's even got a Molotov. So no touching the bomb here. You can you can take, take a little what you like, Shox. He's no, you're not on it. And uh, we'll see him be taken down. There it is. NIP will confirm that we are heading to Inferno.
Charging down middle, a lot of CTs on pistol rounds have been flirting with aggression, Hank, and it's coming in again. Yeah, we see a lot of this these days, and it will be rares to open things up. That fantastic shot, but Zywu from the underpass will be pulling one back there. Four and four with Masuta. He'll be under scrutiny towards the second middle position, and the CTs can't find enough action here. Micro drops. And that's a couple of clocks bullets to do the job here. Man advantage vitality. They still have two smokes and Molotov available. And Nork, he'll be given his pistol. Doesn't look great, but the crossfire, promising. Nork has a real chance, but misses the first. And Apex, he was so prepared for that. Plopsky's trying to get the dunk on, but repositioned. It's Masuta, and reload. now he can't even find the bullets. Just res. Maybe the first, but Shocks had the P250. One quick click gets him the first and the pistol for vitality. Yeah, it's um, it's new. No one will be going near T Sport. No one will ever oh, go. Oh, okay, what? Bloody hell twist! That was a drive-by. Rez gets an easy one. He even puts bullets into shocks as well. That shot, so fast. Masuta was just trying to swing into the angle. Thought he had the element of surprise, and I believe he did. But it's like a scouter like, who wants to stand yeah, on the brackets, so it's all falling apart. And it's not often that. Zaiwu is the individual missing smoke, shots, or anything whatsoever. So this one here could turn very quickly. Jeez, that's just one tiny detail of the round, and they're down to a two on four, and their HP is... Other than that, it's pretty much the same. Oh, he could have bided his time. Perhaps I vulnerable think... now. Vitality can still win this. They certainly can with a frag like that. Now, despite the low HP, they need to get that bomb down. They'll be planting very safe. You can play from apps if you can get there. Doesn't look like that's their intention. Really does look great for an IP to win the second round here. But if Shox could <laughs> hit the first, wow, Plopsky makes no mistake in finding that. And now both of them, they are lined up, but Plopsky, he profits from the low HP. It is just two clicks of his mouth. But the angle looked good. Oh, Masuta's okay. doing it again. It's like Mirage. He has one of these rounds where he just decides he's going to get all of them. This time, Lekro will catch one. Quickly found by Zaiwu in response. Bomb to be planted. Plopsky will spot him. Zaiwu's going to be forced to reposition. They know where both of them are here. So, certainly not far out of the realms of possibility. Shock's forced out of position thanks to the CT incendiary. Ooh. On the flash. Zaiwu avoids it. He's going to get overwhelmed. The transfer. And Shox is there in support. <laughs> no. That was a mad control of his AK spray. Sails up. You'd expect this sort of pacing, considering the weapons they've got. They know the money's well on the CT side. Just trying to be oh, unpredictable. Oh. There's a lovely shot to open things up there. Lack of helmet for Twist certainly being an issue, but not so much for Lepro. He's on for his third here, but not going to happen. It's Rez to pick it up, and that's towards oh, the arch my. side. RPK will keep them in the round, though. Two versus one. Plopsky, one smoke. No kits. M4 in hand and smoked out from the side itself. Tough one for Plopsky. Does manage to catch the timing on shocks. RPK wasn't there, but it's the two of them. Swiss to smoke them off, and we'll see whether this first kill comes in. It looks good. He's at least Ooh. worth one here. Yeah, he doesn't quite get it. Masuta, however, onto Twist, and good damage from Rez. The sound is restored, so is Lecro's Deagle. He's got two. Phenomenal work from the Swede. He's kept them competitive. This was just the Desert Eagles. This was just the half by. And Plopsky's got another. Oh, Vitality. They've come so far. Now they could lose to just the Deagles. He's lined something up. Wants to play around that smoke. He can jump on top of the box and peer above it. Does keep him safe from the incendiary. RPK, he could do this again. But oh. Plopsky's so quick to trade. He does find it and NIP secure their second. Very committed and alone towards B. A beautiful play from Apex. Boosting up on the half wall here, but Zywa will be spotted. Shot through the smoke. It's a headshot. No smoke down in CT spawn, but the trade will come through. Smoke found by RPK, so we'll deploy that now. His teammates need to get in there quickly, which they will. Shocks you the bomb. The plan is that Shocks is going to get the trade. There will be a stagger, though. Yeah, he can get that. And now even find a chance into the second. Shocks, he'll punish. And Lecro closing in. He has a smoke and a kit. It is on Lecro, and he's gone down. All on to Rez. He can't deal with Masuta. And Vitality, they defend the bomb site with two hearts still beating. Well, it's quad. Not many players will focus his area. See Voxic and Twist do it the most. And he does hit the shot, but doesn't get the kill. First will be found by Apex. That's towards Arch. He's boosted up. He's let them in. Nork, what's waiting? What are you waiting for? It was a flashbang. We got to see just the tail end of it. And as his vision was restored, he does catch Apex. So the trade frag's there, but he's not ready for Zywu. Wow, he blind. through the flash, he manages to find the frag. I don't think Zywu is ready for Zywu right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sure, They're so dang. close to it. It was an LMG.
Okay, I'm kind of. Maybe we should I, get I, it I've kind of given up on Sorry, this project. Sorry, Rush, yeah. I did bait you into yeah, that. What do you call that? Castabated? Yeah, he could call it that, I suppose. We can think about that. So, however, has taken down Twist. That's the B defense completely open for business, but they're coming back towards oh, the get domain. Oh. He's got one. Oh. oh, easy frag for the Negev. Rez finds one in the apartments. He does feel the pressure, but he's going to be able to reposition himself onto the balcony. At oh, least he's got on. a lot of bullets, oh, and they find Zywoo. Oh, and Legro can mop it up. It actually works. <laughs> the hero Negev. <laughs> And he expects them to disrespect his smoke, and that's what the nade was designed for, punishing, and very much so. RPK down to 43. He will still find Rez, though. Wall banged. Zaiwu, that's a big frag to find, and now he can even open up another. He eats the flashbang. Will be forced back in. I don't know. There's no clear winner here. It's just a brawl. It's just deathmatch. Everyone's <laughs> shooting at pixels. Well, it goes down to the 2-1-2 two -two now, but a lot of damage inflicted on either side. Plops oh, down to 7. All for Zaiwu. Apex on the AK-47. Oh, they kind of managed to get into the site, and Nork's managed to trade. He knows Zywu was around the pit. He's got time to mess around with the angles a little bit. There is a kit on site. Oh, and he gets the fight. Zywu shuts him down all right. Trying to find anything he can here, but Paul was spotted and taken down, shot in the back of the head. And Lecro with the Max 7 in the back of the pit here. It all come down to Vitality not checking Ooh. it. It doesn't look like they're gonna check it. it doesn't look like they're even gonna think about it. And now he can get one. Oh, good damage if he dunks him. Yes, he kills him, I he think. He certainly could have, but oh. RPK will cower. Electro delaying if Masuta goes down, finally. With 25 seconds left, but Blobsky does enough. It's a 10-5 half. Electro confirms that Arch is clear, and I think actually comes through the smoke there. It's gonna be Electro down to 13. Yeah, and now one's cross. Shox has that information. He's expecting a second, and they find them. Oh, my God. Carl, every single player is dying to Zywu. He gets himself a quick double. Shox has done the same. It leaves Nork with it all to do. And a great first shot. Bomb retrieved and a USP upgrade. Maybe there's still something to be said about this one. Well, time will tell. The bomb's certainly going to be planted, and that means Masuda and Apex have got their oh. approach chosen. That's going to be both of them swinging around. The SMGs oh, can take Plopsky any minute. Yeah, it just feels like a matter of time. They l completely neglected to worry about logs. He caught a nade. He's only got 17 health, but now NIP spring to action. That double push from the French is going to cost them the round, just like that. Sweet this corner. He's very good with the it's Deagle. The oh, sees enough. So did Zywu. He'll take the Deagle delivery and accept. Pretty standard stuff, but there's going to be a lot of players on this side of the map. Molotov's decent. MP9 will only be good for the first, and Shox needs to find multiple kills in. Masuta, Shox, and RPK will drop the bomb down. 30 seconds remaining. Nork on the other side. He's already got a kill. They know exactly where he is. And with 48 HP, all he can really do is smoke spawn. Incendiary down again. We'll just have to grab the bomb and hope for the best here, but he's going to burn before he even gets a chance to. And there it is. 13 to 6. They answer back with a force by their own. And he has been spotted. And the instant trade. It's probably a kill for Popsky here, and indeed he'll convert. Masuta, lot of trouble. RPK gets caught by Rez's Mac 10. And now look at Plopsky. He's taken up so much ground. He's going to start putting pressure on shocks. He's got to deal with Plopsky. He has to deal with him now, and he has. Quickly traded. Nork dropping off the balcony. Another jewel. Oh, nice shot. And another dead Frenchman. So Masuta to go clutch here. We'll segregate the two by dropping the incendiary out. Nork, though, handles it well. Gets three kills in the round, and IP will keep the head above water for now. They look to get aggressive this time towards Banana. The Orb on the corner. Lovely shot from Zywu. You don't expect him to miss many of these. And he's going to nail the second as well. Will they anticipate in the third? Apparently not. This is looking very good for Vitality now. Two players remain for an IP. That's Nork and Twist. And Zywu is still happy to hunt for this kill. The incendiary goes down. They stack them as well. And that's all onto RPK. Spot him. Trying to get the trade, but a missed Orb shot does leave him now recovering. With the AK pushing in, we'll find the first. Apex close up, Twist. He's got to deal with this now, but switching. And Apex, great push. But Zywe, he can make this work. He needs two kills, though. Shocks will help him out here, looking for a series point. They have to do a bit more work, though. Two on two. Lecro will survive with two kills to his name. He's towards quad. And there are kits available, but just one flashbang. They'll be thrown to open things up here in the two on two. Lecro, they're doing so much work. Oh, and this fumbled the... the movement. Twist was just trying to stay alive there. And now 
The bomb can just be defused. If he gives up his position, Lecro, they can just tap the bomb and it's done. But he comes from Arch. He might have done enough here. One versus one. Masuta, the young gun, goes to the fake defuse. And Lecro not biting on it whatsoever. <laughs> He's confirmed the round at this stage. He's just waiting for it to be confirmed. And here we go. Oh, oh, no, but he might have it. He might have it. He's got it. 15. Oh, I can't believe what? it. Lecro, he forgot where he planted that plant oh. spot, though it is safe. It's down to the crossfires. They've got full mid control on the T side. RPK. Trying to make this one work for the hay bales and oh, sideways spotted. Just trying to get one before he's dropped now. Yeah, I don't know how he's going to get out of that situation, especially like that. The A site's open for business. This is a round just like that. NIP, two quick kills. If he just gets a couple, even one, that would be worth it. There it is. The kill comes in. It's going to make buying going forward now almost impossible. They're going to have $1,900 in terms of loss bonus here. The wall bang. Not going to find a kill. Convert. And the flash so good that it knocks shocks off his perch. An RPK burning. They have the sound cue. They know uh, he's hiding. And he will get wall bang, no less. Twist knew it's so convicted. He manages to get the kill. Shocks, however, needs another. A lot of heads about to appear. And he does manage to take another oh. kick in and scream in. Apex from the 2D2. flank. A two versus two indeed. And with the bomb being planted now, the shots. Twist is going to be staring exactly at this position. It's going to be a hard one to hit. He oh. hits the dink. Perhaps softened up for Masuta. Unfortunately, he will not. And so Plopski finding the headshot. Zywu given the responsibility of B, and it will be an AWP on AWP action again. Zywu finding the first blood. Will he? Oh. Oh, no, he doesn't. He will not surrender. He's got a double. Three frags away from the survival in this lower bracket. NIP. Molotov shocks out of position. RPK tucked in on the balcony. He will be found. Rez with one. Here and if go. they find a second, Back perhaps in. overtime is on the cards after all. It's actually advancing an RP now with those two kills down. They can actually get the oh. bomb planted here and we'll see whether there's a chance. Apex trying to sneak through. One more round for Vitality would be enough. Lecro doesn't want to peek from the graveyard here. There's too much on the line, but they'll take him down. This is surely not going to happen, but I think it has to. We're going to overtime. 15 to 10, converted by NIP. Through the smoke. Yeah, that's the plan. A flash avoided by Apex and Masuta. They still have their vision. They've still got their bullets. And they do seem to be doing enough. Lecro seems to disagree. If he could get away from this one, I don't know how. A smoke, that could be the perfect opportunity. And oh, Zai was in trouble too. A flash, he's going to go construction. They still haven't planted. The rotate's coming in from RPK. Now found. Perhaps the Swedes can turn this around as well. This would be unreal. If they give this round up after getting the first two picks, their vitality has just dropped off astronomically at this point. Zywu towards the coffins, and his teammates will back him up there. It's going to be a very convincing close to the round. He's taking a bit of space, and then some. Flashed off, that reveals his position. But a good flash might buy them some time. Plopski's lost a lot of his health. Ooh, they have Mac 10 trying to find the damage required here. It's going to be another scrappy finish. It's not clear he'll be winning the round, but it is going to be the Desert Eagle at the back here. Zywo still oh. fighting for his life. That's a beautiful shot. One versus one. Has he got anything left in the tank? And it will be Rez to find the first and only round here. The latter has got the AWP. Fires between the wickets, and this could be the access point. Does this where they close things out? Hit Not one. will get the first, and doesn't connect on the second, but a great incendiary will Wait, slow what? him down. No, no scopes. Zywu straight through the smoke, it seems. They're running out of health to defend this. They've got three, but they're so low. Masuta's going to be exposed to the boost. Yeah, walking over the edge of the smoke. It's worked wonderfully. Nork's got three. When it matters most, tested on his sight. He's got five players rushing him, and with an AWP of all weapons, he's managed to make it work. Has to finish this off, though, and Shox gives it a good go. It will be Apex left standing. He is only going to stop the first. He's top of middle right now of all the information. They can actually justify bringing a player over. He's oh, tough back, and it's going to be Norka the first again. While blind, and there will be a response. This is looking good now for the close. No rotations as of yet. A deep smoke and CT spawn. This is where it should end. Time. It's getting towards that fourth quarter way mark. Apex onto one. Looking for his third frag, and he's got it. Vitality. The marathon is over. It's the French that prevail.